Item number SCP-7143-J, object class, not applicable. Currently, the Foundation has no protocols by which to contain a doorknob. Special containment procedures. Due to SCP-7143-J being a doorknob, no containment procedures are necessary. Description. SCP-7143-J is a doorknob on the door to the third floor staff dormitory at Site-19. It is made of metal. Turning it to the right or left opens the door to which it is affixed. It has a lock which is used to impede the intended action of turning the doorknob so as to not allow individuals to access the rooms beyond. SCP-7143-J was installed by maintenance associate J. Maloney. When asked about the installation of SCP-7143-J, he remarked, I installed a doorknob. Addendum 7143-J1 Testing Logs Note, a number of tests were run shortly after the discovery of SCP-7143-J. Though the intended purpose of these tests is unknown, as SCP-7143-J is a doorknob. Test Log 7143-J1 Test. Dr. Dorian turned SCP-7143-J to the left. Result. The door to which SCP-7143-J is affixed opened and allowed passage. Note. This is a doorknob. Dr. Dorian. Test Log 7143-J4 Test. SCP-7143-J was locked by Agent Jameson. Result. SCP-7143-J impeded the progress of Agent Jameson. Notes. It seems that this doorknob is locked. Agent Jameson. Test Log. 7143-J15 Test. Data expunged. Result. Data expunged. Notes. I don't know why this is expunged. This is just a doorknob. Dr. Clough. Addendum 7143-2. Personnel personal testimony. Note, the following testimony was gathered during an anomalous survey about SCP-7143-J. I used that doorknob sometimes to get into the third floor dormitory. One time the doorknob was locked, so I came back later and it was unlocked. This is how locks work. Beep. Note. Dr. Hughes' computer appears to be malfunctioning. Dr. Clough. Sometimes I turn it to the left and sometimes to the right. Doors are useful. I once saw somebody cleaning SCP-7143-J. It's like that our facilities workers take such good care of the site. I would flick the crap out of the doorknob!